Tell us a little bit about yourself, like how did you get into cycling? I was probably about 10 when I started and I just joined the village, local village cycle club on a Thursday evening with some friends. Well, I always loved riding my bike. Like I remember some of my some of earliest memories of riding to the little, ride to the cow shed and back. But yeah, just like really enjoyed it. Started on the grass track, then sort of went onto the velodrome and just progressed up there. I very much progressed through the British cycling performance pathway to where I am now. And a lot of memories are in this very velodrome. It's sort of my home track. I got the train down yesterday, very much felt like I was back in my junior days. I used to do, do the same journey every week to Chat League and yeah, it just, it's always nice just walking in and being here. Do you expect the crowd here, it being so special, to push you to another level this weekend? Oh yeah, I still, like commies was insane. Like I've never experienced anything like it. The roar of the crowd, it gave me shivers and almost like I can't, I can't feel my legs. I remember that first lap of the Team Pursuit. It was, I was like, I can't feel anything. This is amazing. <laughs> it travels round with you because you're going around the track. Travel, the sound comes with you, which is, yeah, the most surreal thing. Coming into the TCL at the beginning of the season, yeah. what did you kind of expect from everything? Getting an absolute kicking every week, <laughs> to be honest. Like, it's such a high level of riders here and sort of racing, which I've only sort of just stepped up into. So my first like senior race is already this year. So it's been pretty cool to step up into it and go actually like I am competitive against them, which is nice. Sophie Lewis can afford to enjoy this. Sophie Lewis makes a name for herself. It's given me a lot of confidence, which is nice. And just like the whole tactical side of it, like trying different things, like it is a not a high pressure environment. So you can, like in the races, you can try different things and go actually, that didn't work. Well, actually, that, that worked quite well. Like, I wouldn't normally attack in a scratch race, to be honest with you, from 10 laps to go, but I did it and actually it paid off. So it's given me a lot of confidence that I can do, I can do stuff like that and not just wait for the sprint. 